Okay, uh, I'm here with uh, Alex. He, uh, he's a uh, painter and uh, I want to do a little interview with him and uh, he can explain what he does and how long he's been doing it. And okay, so here is Alex, people. All right, so what we got here is a little bit of spray paint art. It's a newer thing, it's just been kind of going around. I don't know, it's kind of popular on uh, YouTube right now, it's where I got into it. Huh? Two years ago, started out as a backyard hobby and this is what came of it. A bunch wow. of paintings. Definitely and a so, talent. And I need, you know, need a place to sell them, so mm -hmm. farmer's market, here we go, you know. Alright. It's like, what am I going to do with 40 paintings, but <laughs> here we go, here it is. This could be your life calling. And, and you know what, you know? I can definitely do this because for a living. You know, you definitely got some serious talent here. Thank you, thank um, you. Just the quality of the work. Yeah. We'll do a little shuffle through here. This probably isn't. Oh, look the at best that. Work. This is what it's all about, man. Art. And I mean, you go on YouTube and you'll find people who can do them in like five, ten minutes. I like to take my time and really focus, you know. Okay, now, um, now have you been doing this pretty much for how many years? Two now. Two years? Right on, probably two and a half now. Okay. And um, and you use strictly spray cans to do it? Uh, yeah, I mean, newspaper for the texturing. You mm -hmm. use some, uh, some spatulas for the detailing, of course. The little uh, pot covers for the planets. Great. Just little Great. household things, you know what I mean? Okay. I mean, everything you can find. I remember when I first started using my mom's pots and pans without her knowing. <laughs> yeah, you know I mean, just came home, oh, mom, I'm going to do a awesome painting and she thought I was crazy uh -huh. and then I come in with all of her pot and pan covers and they're all sprayed over and I'm like oh. really you shouldn't cook with these anymore <laughs> you know what I mean but all right. you know I replaced them and we were all good there so uh -huh. went to the DI got my own pot and pan covers you know what I mean okay so you're uh, basically selling your uh, paintings now online and at uh, local fairs here in Utah yes sir yes sir do you live right here in the local area yeah I live down in Clearfield actually oh, okay I'm, mm -hmm. I'm just over there in Roy okay um, I just have to say how well you're getting Alex and uh, yeah Alex you are definitely a pro whoa good catch guys <laughs> Thank you. what I need is some weights yeah. <laughs> Well, I'm sure you'd probably sell quite a few of them. So all it needs is a good frame, man, and you'd have a you'd have a, some nice art on the wall on the wall. And see the great thing. Yeah, look at that. That's what it looks like in the frame, people. Yeah, right there. Look at that. Hobby Lobby, you want to get them framed? 50% off. Oh, so you're already in the stores. Oh, yeah. Oh, great. Not my paintings, buying but buying frames for my paintings. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. I, right. I, I tried. I tried. Well, you know, you we'll can get there eventually. try to do it, Alex. Okay, I'm here with Alex. He's a uh, spray can, uh, spray paint artist here at the in the park, and uh, we're gonna see him in action. Do one of his uh, um, planet. Uh, do on a planet. Is yeah. that what you're gonna do? Yeah. Okay. You pretty much call it. He's that. gonna do a planet. Okay. Here's Alex. All right. Now I know you've seen this on YouTube, but this is how I do. First mask, of course. <laughs> Core. You gotta protect yourself. All right, and see, right there is just basic like texturing that is done with uh, just newspaper, pretty much. Uh -huh. So simple, you know. You find that in your butt mod, and then the shading is just pretty much just playing black around the back side of the planet, just to kind of give it that kind of dimension feel. I don't know, it, uh, artistically, what you would call it. Uh -huh. But you know, it looks cool. And what planet is this going to be in the end? Any uh, planet, just a planet any, out there in the yeah, galaxy. Any planet your rich mind can come up with. Cool. And see, that's the great thing about this is it's just you can completely go with your imagination, just go with whatever. Uh huh. And because it's spray paint, you have a little bit of a mistake. It's no big problem. Now, see, I messed up with this. I'm supposed to do. Eh, you know what? Forget. We'll do that for now. That's one good thing about art. You never really mess up. Yeah, you, you know, know and especially. Because it can always be fixed. Exactly, and especially with spray paint. I mean, you spray right. something bad, you spray black over it, boom, mm -hmm. there you go. And so that is just pretty much the planet making process. And then you spray whatever around it. I always like to spray a little bit of a color just to kind of get a, you know, some more colors in there. Mm -hmm. To make looking it beautiful, looking beautiful. Then, of course, I mean, usual black for space. Mm -hmm. 
can do other colors, but it's totally up to you. Then, now watch out, don't breathe. You know, oh, yeah. heavy spray. Now, stars is the simplest thing. You just flick of the finger, boom, there you go. Wow. Some stars just like that. See how quick stars uh, appear. Boom. Look at that. There you go. Oh, look at that planet, man. Check out the colors. Oh, I love it. That's the process in that bag. Okay, so your average, uh, your average uh, painting takes about how long? I'd just give it about 40 minutes. 40 tops. minutes? Okay. Tops 30 minimum. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. All right. Well, I really appreciate uh, the interview, and uh, I'm sure all my YouTube uh, fans are going to love to check it out. And uh, thank yeah. you very much. I had and a good time. A thank nice, you for the interview. Uh, nice yourself. interviewing you there. Right. All right. Thank you. A little pain on your hands. Watch oh, out. Oh, that's that. all right. <laughs> thank you. I still have to get the the motorcycle jumpers too. Oh yeah, I saw them over there. I was kind of jealous. Giving people rides. I like how you make the the yeah. effects there, man. Oh yeah, it's totally abstract, but yeah. it looks cool, you know. It blends in, really. That's what I'm saying. You know, it fits it. Look at that, man. It looks like kind of like a mountain in the back, you know. Now, did you get this talent by, did you first see it on YouTube or? Yeah, just uh, surfing the internet one day. And I just stumbled upon it on YouTube and I was like, you know what, I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna right. paint one of these. And then it turned into something I just wanted to do every day. Back over there, voila. All right, and I'll tell you what, I'm pretty stoked to have my work online actually. All right. Okay. If you want to purchase one of these online? I have a Facebook page, Galactic Methods. Uh, go to Alex Ingram, and then it should be one of my sub pages, right there for you. Right. So that's www.facebook.com/slash/slash Galactic Method. No caps. No Galactic caps. Methods. Yeah. Okay. All right, there you have it, YouTube viewers. If you want to order his uh, prints, just uh, go to the Facebook page and you'll get all the information you need. Okay, see you later. Bye-bye.